Hi, my name is Scott Chapman. I'm one of the cardiologists at Meritus Health Cardiology. In light of the most recent event that happened on the National Football League level, we thought it was important just to educate people as much as possible in regards to things that we should be looking out for and also things that might help in a similar incident. I know one of the questions that comes up is, is a heart attack the same thing as a sudden cardiac arrest? And, and the answer to that is no. Uh, sudden cardiac arrest is actually an electrical instability event, in other words, a rhythm problem, where a heart attack is when some of the blood vessels or one of the blood vessels is blocked, causing heart damage. Now, there are many reasons for somebody to have sudden cardiac arrest. Uh, some of them are known in regards to a patient's history, but some of them unfortunately are not known going in. And that does make it very difficult. In other words, a person may not know that they are at risk of sudden cardiac risk, sudden cardiac arrest, but some people uh, do have a history and they have been told by their doctor that they are at increased risk of sudden cardiac arrest. Nonetheless, the, the most important thing uh, in an event like this is time. Uh, time is both important to heart muscle but also brain function. And for this reason, response, quick response, is important in treating this. Um, sudden cardiac arrest happens about 350,000 times a year in America. And unfortunately, due to response times uh, particularly, uh, the success rate at recovery is, is very low. And so one of the things that we can do as a general public is be aware of what to do in a situation when somebody may be having a sudden cardiac arrest. In other words, CPR is critical. Uh, CPR is one of the methods we have in, uh, quickly, res um, in quickly treating somebody that has no pulse. And so CPR training is uh, something that's offered to the public and is quite important. Now, the second thing is something that many people have heard about. It's an automatic uh, electric defibrillator. What it does is it shocks the heart if somebody were having a life-threatening heart rhythm. Now, there are many public places that have AEDs or these defibrillators. And um, of course, what we witnessed on television was at some sporting events, these are also available. But quick response, if somebody has a suspected sudden cardiac arrest and applying the defibrillator um, is, is extremely important and increases the sex success rate quite a bit. Uh, it can even triple the success rate of recovery from sudden cardiac arrest. And so my overar overarching recommendation is that um, as many people as possible get trained in CPR and also be, a, be aware of where there might be an AED in uh, public spaces.